thanks for clicking this video and here is OC Tech. so in this video I'm really going to show you four perfect ways to save data on YouTube so if you are subscribed to this channel subscribe to this channel for more videos so let's get into the video right now this setting that I want to show you doesn't matter your device whether it is iOS or whether it is an Android phone that you are using all that you have to do is just follow the steps and then we do it together i'm going to show you four ways to save data on youtube okay it's just simple steps that i'm going to show you it will not waste much time so if this is your first time just subscribe to this channel then turn on your notification for more videos so if you're on my home page or on my channel on your top right corner you see these settings okay on the top right corner or if you're on your home screen okay just like this on your top right corner you will see this channel icon okay then you click on it then you select settings so when you go to settings on your youtube app then you're going to learn this perfect four ways to save data on youtube so let's get into the first one then we'll continue with it the first one that i'm going to show you we are going straight to our general okay when you go to our general we have some stuff here but we are interested with only the playback in fees playback in fees so let me show you what it means so when we say playback in fees this is what it means so let's say you're on your youtube screen okay your home page and you are scrolling through the videos as you scroll the videos play automatically which detect data from your phone so all that we are going to do now is we are going to turn this one off okay then we will continue with the second step so when you go to your settings again the second thing that we are going to do is we go to auto play auto play and this is what auto play means so this is my video this is one of my videos and we are playing and i want to show you what auto play means but before that let me skip to the end of this video and then let's play then let me show you what autoplay means so autoplay means that when the video gets to the end okay a new video plays without you clicking on that video okay you can see from here up next in one minute one second sorry one second and then it will play automatically so this is what you're going to do we will turn off the autoplay next video in this session so just turn it off so that you save your data whilst you you are not interested in other stuff you just play the videos that you are interested and the third thing that i'm going to show you is the video quality preferences so this is what the uh, video quality preferences means when you're using a mobile network so we have the auto and we have the higher picture then we have the data saver so let me select this video and then let me show you what these three things means so the last one that the data saver okay when you select that one this is how the, your videos will be looking you will not see the video so well but when you select the higher picture you will see it as um, you see it well but not so perfect or so clear but when you select the higher pic um, the recommended one okay the auto you will see that it will show to your um expectation so the choice is all yours is either you select the auto the higher or the data saver and when you select the auto it uses about 5 to 50 megabytes okay as the video size is 60 it will use your data around 5 to 50 megabytes and when you select the higher quality it will deduct data of around 50 megabytes okay out of 60 and when you select the data saver it will use around 5 to 20 megabytes of data from your phone so this is what you're going to do is either you select the auto is either you select the higher quality or you select the data saver okay so the choice is yours. but for me i like putting it at auto okay and this settings applies to the mobile network and then 
the wifi too so the fourth thing that i'll be showing you okay is your notifications when you go to your notifications we have a lot of stuff there this is what you are going to do with notifications we have the recommended videos and then we have the activity on my channel and the act activity on my comment so all these things you'll be getting notification from them and when you get notification from them each message or each notification that comes to your phone deduct data from your service provider you can turn some of this one off then it will save your data so that's all for today next video is on how to increase your phone's speed so if you haven't subscribed subscribe to this channel for more videos there are more videos coming in 2022 so thanks for joining and thanks for subscribing see you